Hi guys, uh, welcome to my channel. My name is Hannah. On my channel, I usually talk about uh, how to uh, how to do stuff in Excel, uh, Word documents, and uh, and so many other stuff. So today, I'm going to show you how you guys can create uh, a site under SharePoint. So um, let me walk you through it while you are under that SharePoint. Uh, access go to create site under the create site uh, section um, you are able uh, give you uh, you want if, if you want to create a, a team site or do you want to create a communication site so uh, what I would like to create is for my team I would like to create a team site and then you can add a team site uh, one of the site I'm creating today is for <clears throat> uh, purchasing department and uh, you can able to add a description in here uh, which it can uh, <clears throat> I'm sorry guys which it could be um, how they can access the site and what they need to update and stuff like that so it kind of uh, an, an instruction how they can use the site and also uh, there is a different kind of uh, language you can able to uh, access here. So I'm just going to keep us in English and then finish. Once I create uh, this site, uh, which you will name it right here on top, uh, you can able to play with, uh, work with, you can able to change the color of this uh, site. Uh, you can able to add a document, uh, different kind of documents in here. So for your team to able to share it. Uh, also to do all that, you can just go here on the right corner of the site, edit, and uh, you can able to uh, um, change your looks, your way, how you want to ever look this up. Uh, one thing to uh, point out here, uh, make sure you're not like if you close this, you will uh, keep your uh, your site under save uh, draft. So you have to make sure uh, it's not on the save draft. Draft is always published. Uh, this is one of the problems I kind of come across with. Uh, I just left the save draft, and then one of the team was trying to edit some stuff here, some future, and uh, he wasn't able to get them because. This, uh, the site still shows under the save as draft. So make sure once you've finished everything, you want to take a look at it and then click publish. And then it will ask you, are you willing to publish this? And you'll say yes, and that will publish it. So for other people to come in and uh, edit or, you know, stuff like that. So when I was saying save draft is for uh, editing the, the looks of the sites, not uh, adding, you know, stuff in here in the document, which still can be accessed. Uh, there is also a side document you can add, a page, uh, different multiple kind of documents. You can add a notebook in here for the whole site. You can use, uh, you can link to your schedule, your calendar in here. Uh, you can use it for as project management. Uh, there is a lot you can do in here. Okay, so this is uh, how you create uh, a site under SharePoint. One thing to mention, let's say if you want to delete a site, uh, what you need to do is right here under the right corner, it's uh, the gear, that setting gears, open that, and then you will go uh, site information, and then you can able to de delete that site here. So for for whatever reason you want to delete that site, that's the way you can delete it. So yeah, I'll show you how to create it and also how you can delete it. So make sure uh, when you delete a site, uh, you you are deleting um, the right site, so you're not deleting by mistake. Uh, once you delete, it's delete. Okay. Uh, uh, also, uh, if you have a multiple sites, that kind of help how you know you make sure how you delete this site. All right, guys, this is all I have for today, creating uh, a site under SharePoint. I will talk to you on my next uh, content and my next video. Again, thank you for sharing, liking, and subscribe my channel. I appreciate it. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.